MGM presents Your body needs you Starring the immune system This is your body These are the three areas that are very important to your immune system The spine the thymus gland and the lymph glands your stem cells are born in bone marrow such as your spine they have no function yet but can develop into any cells like fighter or helper cells High doses of sugared foods and drinks over a short period of time causes all production of stem cells to stop for a full five hours. After they're born, they travel to the thymus gland at the base of the throat. The thymus gland is the college for the stem cells, where they are screened and sorted according to aptitude before being sent for specialist training. Some will become your fighter T cells or CD8s. They train until they're needed to fight infections. And others will become your helper T cells or CD4s. The helper T cells are your body's detectives. Before being sent off into your body, the trainee cells are tested. If they fail the test, they are killed. The thymus gland or college shuts down or shrinks when your body does not get enough zinc. If they qualify, they are sent to the lymph glands. The lymph glands are all over your body and are the army barracks for your body's immune cells. The helper cells wander around the body looking for anything foreign, which they compare to their memory identikits of what is part of the body and what is not. A germ enters your body. This is an infection. The helper T cells see this foreign body, the germ, and scans it against its memory banks. It realizes the germ is dead. Dangerous. The helper T cell runs to the B cell, a smart cell, and shows it the identity of the germ. The B cell then becomes a massive factory cell and starts to produce chemicals called antibodies. Thousands of antibodies go in search of the identified germ, and once they bump into it, they attach themselves to it like a handcuff. High doses of sugary foods and drinks also stop the production of antibodies. A patrolling fighter cell sees the antibody handcuffed to the germ. It races off to wake the other soldiers, who then also race all over the body, searching for the germ. And they kill them. When all the germs are dead, the infection is over. You need to drink lots of water when fighting an infection to flush the junk out. An autoimmune illness like arthritis or multiple sclerosis is caused when the helper T cells incorrectly identify a normal, healthy cell as a germ. This leads to the production of antibodies against the healthy cells and the fighter cells do their job and they kill off the healthy cells. Suppressed immune system illnesses like cancer and AIDS are caused when the helper T cells are either too few or not active enough. This means that there are too few antibodies produced against the illness and the fighter cells do not wake up to fight the illness. You have already seen how certain things such as very high doses of sugary foods or drinks can harm your body's ability to fight infections. You've also seen how specific substances in food such as zinc are critical in helping the body fight germs. In the next section of this DVD, 
we will look at what else your body needs to stay healthy, to prevent illness, and to recover after an illness.